a long weekend ahead with plenty of time to get outside, so if you're planning on some activity, why not support a local organization while you're at it? That and more in this week's INRI. The Girls on the Run annual Spring 5K goes virtual this year. While everyone can't be together this time around, the 5K aims to celebrate each girl in the program. You're encouraged to run, walk, bike, even jump your way through the 3.1 miles in your own neighborhood or outdoor space. The event is open to anyone and you can do it at any time that is convenient to you through the weekend. Participants will receive a race shirt, digital race bib, and digital finisher certificate. All proceeds will directly benefit Girls on the Run Rhode Island, which helps girls in grades 3 through 8 develop essential life skills and establish a lifetime appreciation for health and fitness. Get excited for a little bit of normalcy, making a return. All state parks are now open once again with restrictions, and on Memorial Day Monday, two state beaches will reopen to the public too. East Matunic and Scarborough will once again open up their parking lots to visitors, but with limited capacity. There will also be no facilities open, but you can get outside and enjoy the sunshine and sea breeze. The remainder of the state beaches are expected to open at some point during phase two. And Squamakit Beach may not be open yet, but their drive-in is. Each weekend, they are showing a different movie that you can watch from the comfort of your car. This week, it's Jaws 2. Tickets must be purchased in advance, and of course, as with all things right now, are limited. But they'll continue to do this all summer long, so be sure to check back for future dates if you can't get in this weekend. And local restaurants are now open for outside dining. Lots of places have gotten really creative setting up outdoor spaces or even opening up a picnic or lawn area like the Chandler. But not every restaurant is offering that option right now, so be sure to check with your favorite spots ahead of time to see what they're doing. I'll post the info for all of these activities on our website, roadshow.com.